And then there's probably a good 60 or 70 rigs here. Welcome my friends, Seven Gray here. Today I am traveling to the Van Life Gathering in Idaho for the month of June. They don't really have a title for this event, it's just called Van Life Gathering. Um, I just found out about it actually this morning from somebody who was leaving the campsite where I was boondocking and heading over this way. So I decided to uh, fill out the form, apply, and head this way since it was only about an hour away. And so here I am. I have arrived at the van gathering and there's probably a good 60 or 70 rigs here. All sorts of Sprinter vans, Promasters, a lot of uh, little VWs, uh, Vanagon. There's lots of uh, different vehicles. There's schoolies, some RVs. I'm headed right now to an opening ceremony that's going to take place at a fire pit. Welcome. <laughs> um, we're really excited to have you all here. There are still more people coming, um, but we wanted to kind of kick things off. They're having the meeting back over here and they're explaining all the things for the weekend. There's a lot of stuff going on here. This is really a nice event. They are gonna have free beer after this meeting. They have a potluck, they have a free meal one night. They have raffles with a wee boost prize, a bunch of other prizes. This is pretty darn cool. I really like this event. Um, they just had a presentation by a zero waste um, couple that is gonna be dealing with um, basically doing uh, composting, zero use of plastic, zero landfill, um, really impressive. Uh, and I want to learn more about that, so I'm going to try to drop past there in a bit and talk to them. I'm parked back over here. You can see me in the distance, and right next to me is another step van. This is owned uh, by Tile, and uh, he goes on Cheap RV Living by the name of Putt, which is the name of his step van. And then he has a little dog named Dart. So hopefully I'll get to do a tour with him before the end of the event because I love doing step van tours. There's a potluck meal going on here this evening, seven o'clock. I love that number. And so everybody's gathering back over here around the fire and bringing their food, a lot of delicious stuff over there. I'm gonna wander over, check it out. This is the gathering back here of people for the seven o'clock potluck meal. Quite the crowd. I'm gonna go check out the dishes. I'm here with Matt. Matt is the one of the organizers for this event and I'm going to ask him a few questions about the event and just uh, learn a little bit more about what's happening here. Hey, my name is Matt Swartz and uh, I run a little project called The Van Project and this is the first annual Teton Valley Van Life Gathering. Uh, my girlfriend Amanda and I organized this. We wanted to create a community building event for people living nomadic lifestyles and we found this great location on recommendation of someone else who uh, travels and lives out of a van. We had quite a few events uh, starting on Friday when we welcomed everyone here. We had some folks here from the Leave No Trace Foundation who uh, kicked this off as a Leave No Trace event. Um, we wanted to do everything we could to recycle, keep the property clean, leave it better than we found it. 
So on Friday, we also had a great potluck dinner where everyone cooked a dish and brought together. Uh, we were able to have a really nice community dinner uh, cooked and fed by ourselves. And then on Saturday, we had some sunrise yoga, which was sponsored by Shine Organics, one of the big sponsors for the event. So they really showed up and helped us hire an instructor, provided some food, we ate some snacks afterwards, some healthy snacks. And then we had an awesome raffle with some really great gear from some of our other sponsors. We had a community barbecue dinner on Saturday night, sponsored by Kettle Potato Chips. That was fantastic, everyone had a great time. Uh, and the Lynn family who owns the property where we are hanging out really outdid themselves. They made a, an amazing meal with locally sourced food. It was really awesome. And then every night we've been enjoying a nice bonfire, some socializing, some beers. We had a swap meet today on Sunday. And now people are getting wrapped up. We're getting ready to, to head on to whatever's next after this. We are starting to get some rain. I'm gonna go put the camera away. That's all I have for this episode. Thank you for watching. Savor the moment. See you next episode.